The Clark County School District hit with a lawsuit. Students alleging their First Amendment rights to free speech were repeatedly violated. Fox 5's Kim Passoff is outside district headquarters to explain. Kim? Yeah, members of the Students for Live Club say that their First Amendment was violated, that their pro-life views were repeatedly censored. This is the lawsuit that they filed against the district and their high school, East Career and Technical Academy, laying out those allegations of discrimination. I really do believe that high school should be a point in which students are able to uh, grow in their, in their um, core beliefs and expand and look into different viewpoints. Felipe Avila, now a college freshman, spent four years at East Career and Technical Academy, where he was the leader of the Students for Life Club. I consider myself to be a very devoted student in my, um, my education, and it can be tough when you have an entire team of administrators actively working against you. He says he and the club were repeatedly censored. So we had a flyer that we submitted announcing one of our meetings and the assistant principal at the time, um, she told us that it was too controversial. The group also tried to put an ad in the student newspaper where other clubs were allowed to promote meetings. But again, he says they were told no. The school uh, basically ignored our request and uh, they refused to give anything in writing. And what we would see a lot of times is I would be in the middle of class and they would pull me out of class to give me a verbal denial. And it was very, very clear that they didn't want anything in writing. Felipe says he felt targeted for trying to share an unpopular viewpoint. It came to the point where I was pulled out of class numerous times a day just to receive a denial. So this was very disruptive to my educational experience on campus. He says though the Students for Life pro-life message was often censored, this pro-choice poster was displayed in a classroom. First Amendment rights should be protected regardless of whether you're pro-life or pro-choice. Um, so as much as this is about um, protecting um, pro-life speech, it's, it's really about protecting freedom of speech for anyone. We're pushing back and we want to make sure that students have their First Amendment rights protected. And we reached out to CCSD about this lawsuit. They say that they cannot comment on pending litigation. Back in 2015, the district was sued by another student when she was not allowed to start a pro-life club at her high school. Reporting live tonight, Kim Passoff, Fox 5 News, local Las Vegas. And that lawsuit against CCSD was filed in federal court on Thursday. We'll have a link to the complaint on our website, fox5vegas.com.